it to do a little bit more pictures because I have so many cute outfits and I don't know I just she grabs stuff oh my god are you eating your pants hi my friends how are you guys doing today today is Sunday fun day it's an afternoon we actually relaxed all day actually it's like five o'clock almost five but it's dark it feels a lot like later than it is but anyways we woke up from our second nap not me though emma did emma did you wake up from your second nap say hi i have a variety of toys in here because i grab and everything right you look at the camera yes you are i'm going to change her right now and today today this little girl turned three months old did Emma turn three months old today? Yay! Mm, I feel so sad. My baby's growing up. She's so cute though, you guys. She makes different noises. She she demands things. Yeah? She's like independent. If I'm feeding her, she'll push me away like that. Saying enough. I don't want any more. Right? This vlog, we're going to do an update on... Three month update on Emma. And also, I'm going to be doing a photo shoot for her. Yeah, I don't know if you guys knew, but I do take nice pictures. Um, this camera was given to me a long time ago by my husband. I think for our second year anniversary, he got me this Canon uh, Rabble, whatever that is. I love it. Uh, you can't vlog with it. It only films for 10 minutes, so forget about that. And then I have her little dress that I prepared to vlog with. And her little bow and then I have so a couple of other dresses that I want to take pictures of her because she's running out of you know she's growing and she hadn't had a chance to really wear them out um, yeah I'm like a crazy mom who wants to take pictures of my child is three months old today so we're gonna do an update right Emma and she keeps dropping her binky um, so there she is um, she's about 13 pounds and two and a half ounces and uh, she smiles a lot as you guys know on our vlogs she definitely talks a lot back she moves a lot and she tries to grab everything including my hair we're absolutely in love with her. I'm gonna put her pinky right there. Right, Emma? She's such a good girl. She sleeps through the whole night now. She eats pretty well. And we just wanted to do an update. Three months old update. Right, Emma? Is that true? I love her, you guys. She's wearing little shoes. <laughs> it took me 30 minutes to wear these shoes on her. I'm not even joking. She kept, um, she kept taking the shoes off when I was trying to wear them. Well, anyways, this is uh, a little bit different of what I'm doing today. Today's Sunday. Ryan is working on his podcast. And me and Emma are just relaxing and I'm enjoying. I did a lot of photo shoot uh, for her, um, dressing her up in the different outfits that she has, including this one. This was one of the first dresses that I bought from her. For her, I believe it was Baby Gap. I'm not sure. I think so. Let me see. Who is it by? Oh. Nope. I'm lying. It's Jean Berries. I got this when I went to visit my mom back in May this year. And um, it says three to six months. I guess it's like a tonic because like I have a little pants for her. Like these ones that I got at... Um, 
I got these at Children's Place. They were closing down. They were closing down, so I got this little leggings type of thing in different sizes for different age. These ones are actually six months, but it's okay. It will work out right now, too. But, yeah, we are getting big, and we're so excited. I can't wait. Um, I don't even understand um, the concept of, like, when I look at the older videos, or oh, she's tiny. When she was just born, you were so tiny, honey. You were half of your size exactly yeah you were half of your size and uh she's she's an incredible child we're truly blessed yeah she's looking oh. around everything yeah are you talking are you saying hi to everyone she had a professional a photo shoot done uh when she was five days old I did to do a little bit more pictures because i have so many cute outfits and i don't know i just she grabs stuff. Oh my god, are you eating your hand? No. She loves her binky. She had this binky since day one. If you look at the birth vlog. Yeah. She absolutely... I do wash it. Um, she does love this little guy. It's the Um. I don't know. I, I can't even explain how much I love this girl. But she had changed our lives forever. Just wanted to do a little bit of update. She is uh, still sleeping in her um, rock and play, which is cool. During the daytime, she'll sleep in a crib and play. And she had tried to pull on Panthros, our cat's hair. He was really nice about it. The dog is still afraid of the baby. Pretty much afraid of the baby. Yep. Yeah, today's a really short vlog, you guys. Just wanted to do an update. I just actually, I think on Sundays we might do like one take type of deal. Um, one take Sunday because we want to enjoy the time together. Um, but depends. Yeah, the weekend is amazing. The weekend is amazing. Um, now, we celebrate Hanukkah and Christmas and New Year's. I am not sure if we're going to have a Christmas tree because last year when we, no, this year actually, springtime, when I was about three and a half months pregnant, Ryan decided to clear out the whole basement. And I don't know, he was a guest nasty, you should say. And he threw our Christmas tree, our ornaments, our like everything that had to do with Christmas, old lights, including everything for Hanukkah, like all the decorations were gone. Halloween, Hanukkah, Christmas, everything was gone. Uh, Valentine's Day, pretty much. He's like, we'll buy new ones. So I think this year, probably this coming up next week, we'll maybe go uh, buy a little tiny Christmas tree. And we'll, um, we'll get like ornaments that maybe she would like. Maybe the pinks and the silvers, you know. And I'm thinking maybe we'll put it in her room. Because Pantro, the cat, will destroy the Christmas tree if it's a, uh, you know, real Christmas tree. I have no idea. Um, it'll probably be really tiny. And for Hanukkah, we're going to light the lights. And I got her a couple of um, gifts, a little bit of a gift. And we're going to, I think we're going to open all the gifts for New Year's. Uh, because that's the tradition that I grew up with. Because in Russia, they didn't really celebrate Hanukkah or Christmas like they do here. Um, so we would do New Year's. So you would open up your gifts on New Year's. I think I'm going to keep that tradition. And Ryan is uh, totally fine with that. Um, you know, oopsies. That way it makes it fair. And then that way she could open up all the gifts she wants. Well, she's not going to be able to open them to give us this year. But yeah, we'll definitely we'll put them under the tree on Hanukkah day and Christmas day and then we'll open them up on the New Year's day but the best gift that we've ever gotten last year around this time we did our fertility for the last time I said I'm just gonna do it for the last time and see if it's gonna finally work and it did so second day of Hanukkah first day of Christmas the morning of Christmas 
we found out we got the phone call that we are absolutely a hundred percent pregnant and that the the pregnancy looked good by the blood work and the hormones look good so that was the most incredible phone call what happened and she'll do a lot of that now she gets really fussy and she gets frustrated what do you get frustrated for she wants to sleep i'm not gonna let her sleep early because because if she sleeps early right now she's not gonna be able to sleep through the night so um yeah it was the best thing in the world we are gonna try to have a second child probably come spring we'll try for that i'm gonna go see the doctor and talk to the doctor and see what the doctor says if we could naturally um get pregnant that would be wonderful if not maybe then next year sometime summer we'll try to do fertility again but other than that we are absolutely amazed by this little girl you guys but this little girl is a miracle i love you the best gift ever all right you guys she's getting fussy i'm gonna finish this vlog slash three month update right one of these days i'll film our fertility story i had it actually when we did the fertility journey but i don't know where the footage went i think i accidentally might have erased it and then the sd card that it was on uh, it's from four and a half years ago uh, can't find it anywhere well you guys i just fed this little girl right emma i love you okay you guys we're gonna call it a night i hope you enjoyed this little update a three month old update right Emma? please subscribe comment down below and let us know what's your favorite outfit that emma wore today for her little photo shoot three month update make sure to subscribe if you're new if you have not subscribed please subscribe and hit the bell to get notified when we post a video by the way we post a video every single day all right you guys good night and we will see you guys when emma We'll see you tomorrow.